Okay, well, now I've changed the plans kind of a bit again. I think I'm gonna try try to figure out where the nearest or find the nearest village and transport a villager here. <laughs> um, I seem to be stymied at every turn. And I think I'm being stymied mostly by my own thoughts. <laughs> so I'm going to go get a nice sleep and uh, go look for a nearby village in the morning. So this is the place that is probably the nearest to the village to get, you know, if I was going to get a villager and put them in a boat, I could bring them right here to this river right here, make a little tunnel that wouldn't really be that too long to get them over here. I guess maybe the tunnel should go right along there. So that means that I want to find a village that's on the sea and get my villager from that. We'll see if I can do that. I, I may have already found one in the desert over there. Was that desert by the sea? It may have been. So now I'm going to go boating to find a village on the sea. Here we go. Well, maybe we'll find um, some cold land up here, some snowy land where we can find the igloo with the weakness potion and then my plan will change all over again, which is, you know, it's what I do. Why keep to the same plan when you can change it over and over again? <laughs> and I haven't been, I don't think I've been really too far up this way. There's so many polar bears. Okay. Whoa! Oh, no, 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 no. No, what's going on? No, 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 no. Okay. That's not okay. That's not okay. It messed up my boat. Oh, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. Okay, I gotta swim. Oh, my gosh. I was not expecting that. I was expecting to be nice and safe. Oh, Oh, I'm being chased by drowned and they killed my boat. Are they still following me? Oh, they're still following me. Oh, no, no, I'm drowning. Oh, this is terrible. Okay. Oh, so I just uh, went blithely past that underwater ruins there. And a horde of drowned came up and shot my boat. So I have no boat. And then shot me a bunch of times. And here I am, stranded. Absolutely stranded. Okay, I'm going to need to get wood to make another boat because I don't have didn't bring any wood with me because that was super clever and let's see it's too bad there's not a an igloo here Hold on. I don't want to get like super close to oh that's right <laughs> Mobs can spawn on this ice now. Oh, no, 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 no. I need to find wood. I'm going to have to swim. Huh. 
How much longer do we have to go? Where's the moon? Why can't I see the moon? <laughs> okay. We're getting there. It's going to be sunrise pretty soon. I've got, really got to keep my eye out for underwater ruins below me because those drowned are just a real killjoy. Dang. No, no, don't, don't hurt me. I don't see any underwater ruins right there. You gotta be really aware swimming now in the ocean. You're just not safe like you used to be. <laughs> you can drown really easily too. No. Okay. Well, maybe there's a village right over here. Nope. Oh my goodness. Where's the, there's the nearest tree, perhaps? Okay, let's go make ourselves a couple of boats. Let's go get ourselves some spruce wood. And get back on the road. Ooh, I also want to get... I forgot about that. I want to get some, uh, some sheep as well. One... I want to get some wood, I mean some wool, for a bed so I can sleep. Oh, there we go, there was some sheep, the other side of the ravine. There we go, sheepers. Sheepers creepers. Two. Might as well get a bunch of what we can from these, these guys. Okay. Okay, I'm starting to calm down now. Ooh, we got another jungle. Cool, I wonder if we'll find a bamboo forest here. I know the ocean is back over this way. Maybe it's over this way as well. We'll find out. I can't forget to keep my eye on what I'm supposed to be doing here, which is finding a village close to the ocean. Okay, so we've lost our way a little bit. Look, there's I see I'm seeing desert temples all over the place, but you know, I'm not hugely interested in them right now. I'm going to explore them later if I come across them later because what I really want is to fix this village. I'm bound and determined. It's, oh my goodness. Okay, there we go. Back to the ocean. Okay, let's have some food. We have to keep our eye out. Four. Underwater ruins. It's a nice formation there. Ah. Shipwreck. Dolphins here. It's gotten warmer. 
The water's gotten warmer. Oop, there's, we've got, we've got a village over here this way. Okay, so here we go. Hopefully this is not a zombie village. Whoa, that <laughs> startled me. <laughs> oh, we've got real villagers here. Oh, that's so neat. Who are you? Fletcher. Another worker. Butcher. Another worker. Oh, this is a, an interesting. This is an interesting little well thingy, isn't it? What is this? There's a sheep in there. Look at his little face sticking out there. Arrow. This is the uh, a loom. So this is for. Oh, this is for the weaver or the sheep herder. Do. I really like the new houses. They're so cool. This might be the place right here to take the villager out from. Back into the sea. Out this way. Because I'm not going to have to do too much digging. to get to the sea. And if that's the guardian temple that's really near our home. So we're going to bring the villager here, and we are going to bring the villager right here. Okay. Okay. My canal waterway is done. Almost done. I just want to prettify it up a little bit. Okay, it's midday. I think we can go get our villager now. So basically, what I remember is we travel along this coastline until we get to, I think, kind of the end of these icebergs, and then we go straight across. So we're hugging the coast. There's the Guardian Temple. Pass through here. I think that's us. We're a little too far south. Even if it's not us, is that just a whole other town? I think it is. I think we found a whole other town. Ah. Not a problem. If that's what we did. Yeah, I think we did. Okay, let's see. That's it. I can sleep. There's a farmer here. 
That's cool. We can bring the farmer right down here. Farmer, I'm so happy to have found you. Yeah, okay, so that's awesome. Now I need to get you. Okay. I need to... No, come on. Let's go outside. Let's go outside. Come on. Push you into the boat. Come on, into the boat. Into the boat. There we go. Oh, this is so great. I can just go right over here. We made it. Let's take a look at you. You look fantastic. It's like. Let's go on a little trip then. Where are you taking me? I'm not even exploring this town right now. I'm just getting my villager and going. So we're just going straight. I love that this oceans now have got this terrain to them. It looks so cool. You know, with hills and valleys and underwater mountains and stuff. Dark it out. I'm gonna make it look even prettier later, I think. Okay, but right now. Oops, sorry. Our village, villager was too big. Um, okay, well, we'll deal with that later. Up you go. This is your new home. It's your new home. It's your new home, man. Okay. You want to go look around? Let's let's boat you. Let's boat you over this way. I want you closer to the vi the center of the village so that that I can bring the other one around, the other villager around. And then. There we go. There you go, sir. Excellent. Very good. to sleep okay so we got our villager I can't believe it oh I'm so happy we got our villager he or she is secured we want a vibrant village community here and we need to fix it up. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to fill in these areas here, these ponds, this water over here, and I'm going to build some more houses um, in the style of these houses. And I'm going to probably bring an iron golem into the mix. One, a couple, maybe a couple. I think, or, mm, I'm not sure. We may keep this pond right here.
so I'm gonna get going on that. We've got another patrol. They're just outside the village this time. I wonder if anyone spawned inside the village. Look at me how calm I am. Let's see where they are. There they are. Look at them. They're in the cow pasture. Okay, so let's uh, see what I can do with my little bow. Uh, hmm. See what I can do with my little axe. I didn't really mean to do that, did I? Okay. Go on, wake up, boys, girls. You get him? This is working out good. Yeah. Nice. Got another banner. Where's this last guy? Is he running away? Is he running away from my dog army? No, look at you. Whoa. Ooh, I got a crossbow. Ooh, I got a crossbow. I got a crossbow. Very nice. So yeah, I'm starting to be a little bit more okay with these pillager raids, huh? With my dog army. They make all the difference. They make such a huge difference. I feel confident. I feel confident, brave and strong because of my dog army. Very good. Thank you, boys. So I have made a whole bunch of changes to the village. Let's take a look at them. Um, I've added these, filled in everything. I've added these little houses. I've added, I think maybe like 10 little houses. Um, see, this one is new. That one is new right there. They're all pretty much the same. You can tell they've got these beams up here or the wood log beams up there and the fences across, kind of like the old Minecraft village houses. And I've added three iron golems. Yep. They seem to be getting along quite well. They've already um, dispatched a few patrols. Our farmer's doing well. And I also boated in um, the other villager. Where is he? There you are. There's the greenie that we had. And they have not bred yet. I've give them, given them a bunch of wheat and a bunch of carrots and so far nothing. What's wrong, man? You don't like Mr. Greenie? Look. <gasps> They're throwing carrots. They're at the throwing carrot stage. I'm going to pretend I'm not watching. We're just hanging out over here. Nothing's going on. They like each other. They're throwing carrots. They're looking deep into each other's eyes. Hmm. More carrots have been thrown. I'm not here watching you. More carrots have been thrown? That's a lot of carrots. Still mesmerized by each other. Six sets of carrots. That is a powerful, powerful glare. 
It's like seven sets of carrots now. And it's the greenie apparently throwing them based on the direction they went. And, oh, greenie went and picked them back up. He's like, you don't want my carrots? Fine. Fine. Look, another raid. Let's get the dog army up. Look at them standing all over there. What's going on? Why are they standing still? It seems like there's a raid every, like, clockwork, every four or five days. I should really try and measure what's going on. There's one crossbow guy, banner guy. Oop. Come on, hit me. I dare you. Don't hurt my dogs, though. Hurt me. Come on. Here we go. You don't stand a chance, do you? Okay, so crossbow guy number one is done. Banner guy. Okay, come on. Yep, there you go. Good luck, man. Ow, ow. That's kind of funny. Okay. Okay, so there should be two more. Maybe the golems got them? Okay, we've got farmer in here. Farmer safe. Oops. And greeny safe. Now where are the other patrol guys? Okay, so let's the these uh golems must have gotten them. Is they're over here somewhere? It's interesting that they were all, like, two of them were just kind of caught up right here, as if they wanted to get inside here, kind of. Oh! <laughs> We've got a wandering, traveling merchant. This is very exciting. Hello! A wandering trader. Glowstone from you, gray dye, birch sapling, spruce sapling, brain coral block. That's not bad. I'm taking some of this from you. Podzol, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Oh, look at your little llamas too. I really like them. Wow. And he just appeared in the village. And I'm guessing, you know, that's because this is now properly a village now with villagers recognizing the doors. Very nice.